Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will show you exactly how to solve the problem of temporary hold on successful. We couldn't place a temporary hold on your card. Try hold again. So as you can see, what they are exactly saying is that they are trying to check to see if there is enough money in your debit card so that when it is up to your next payment, they'll be able to deduct the money on your other account. As you may know by now, Facebook ad account, most of the ad account by default are postpaid ad account. They are postpaid. They are not prepaid. Prepaid means that you pay before the advert will run. Postpaid means that you don't need to fund the account. It will run when it reaches to your threshold. Then you will be asked to make payment or the payment will automatically be deducted from your debit card. So as you can see, some attempts were made to deduct money from this ad account, but it failed. Not that they were really going to deduct the money. They wanted to check whether there is enough money. Normally, that money will be refunded to your account. So when you check here, when you add your debit card and you check below here, you will see your threshold. So for example, your threshold may be what? $118. So what it means is that they will check to see if it reaches to the $118. Will there be enough money in your debit card to deduct? And they are doing that because a lot of people will run advert when it reaches to their payment or to the, the, the threshold. Then they will leave that ad account and go and create another new ad account and leave that debt. So that is why they now check to see if you have money in your account. So if you have that problem, this is how to resolve it. First, you make sure that you have enough money up to the amount that they are trying to uh, deduct. So when you check at the payment activity, you see that the threshold here is $118. It, your own will be a different amount. So you check the amount they are trying to deduct. Make sure your debit card has up to that amount. Then you come and click on what? Try hold again. If you click on try hold again, there, there is the likelihood that they will be able to check. And when they check and there is enough money, they will the try hold again. The problem here will vanish and you will see that it has been resolved. And that money they deduct, they are supposed to refund it. And normally you see that they will refund the money back to your account. If they deduct that money and they don't refund it, please, you have to contact Facebook support or contact your bank to let them know they are supposed to reverse the transaction. It is just for them to check whether you have money or not. It is not an actual payment. And you will see that because Facebook, they will not charge you if you haven't run the advert. If you have not run the advert and you don't have an outstanding debt, they are not supposed to deduct that money. They have to reverse it. So that's the first step. If you do that one and it doesn't go through, I will, these are the other steps I recommend you go through, which are supposed to help you to resolve the problem. First of all, in that, you have a problem with that particular debit card. So I will advise you to change the debit card. So you come here and click on add payment method. Then you put a new payment method. You click on um, next, then you'll be able to follow and then add a new payment method. You see, fill the information on the card and save it. After you save it, you will come and then make that particular card your default payment method, okay? So when you click on try hold again, you see, or you can even click on update the payment method here. It will ask you to follow you. It will help you to follow that and then add a card. So when you come back and click on try hold here after adding the card, it is supposed to be resolved if the problem was with the first card because sometimes the problem could actually be with the card. And let me add that some of you, if your, cur your currency, the ad account currency is in dollars and your debit card currency is in a different currency, or vice versa, your your card could also be in dollars, and the debit uh, the other account currency is in a different currency. You must make sure that you make sure the money is far more than the exchange rate, or you check to know the uh, the um the current exchange rate or the right exchange rate because some of you may be using an exchange rate that is lower than the actual rate, so your calculation may be wrong. So the money in the card may be, actually be less than the money they are supposed to check. So make sure that you put enough money in your debit card. So if you try all these procedures and it doesn't work, I will advise that you can create a, a, a new ad account. But before I go to the new ad account creation process, 
what I want to let you know is that we help to resolve some of these problems. You can follow the WhatsApp or Telegram link in the description to WhatsApp us. I also have a very powerful book on achieving your most ambitious goals and dreams that can help you to discover your life purpose, to set effective goals and be able to achieve them. You can check a link to that particular book in the description of this video and follow it to get a copy of the book. Then now when it comes to the new ad account, what I will advise you is, you have to create a business manager and create a new ad account. If you already have a business manager, you come here and then you click on over here, you go to all tools and then you go to business settings and you can create a new business manager. If you don't know, if you don't have that and you have to create a business manager and create a new ad account. So whether you are going to create a business manager and new ad account or you are going straight away to create new ad account if you already have business manager. I have done a detailed video that can help you to do that. and. I will leave the link to the description of that video at the bottom. Check in the, uh, the, the description of this video and you'll get a link to that particular video and follow it to go and watch and you will know how to either create a new ad account or if you don't have a business manager, how to create a business manager and create a new ad account in it. And as I said, you can also follow, you can also contact Facebook live chat support. I will also leave a link to that particular video in the description. Uh, uh, the, the description of this video so that you can follow it to contact Facebook live chat support. You can also check at the top and you'll be able to follow it. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell and like this video for other more powerful videos like this. Once again, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.